In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create an emissive light like you see here. Um, think of Star Wars with lightsabers, things like that, where it's a, a glowing light. Um, so what I will do is drag in a shape, so we'll use a cylinder for this one. And we'll right click, material, and we'll name this uh, glow. Drag that onto the object and open up your material. So hold three on the keyboard to create a color vector and hold one to create a constant value. So then hold M and click to create multiply. Now drag these in to the multiply and plug the multiply into the emissive color. Give it a color, so we'll do this one pink and then give it a value. So we'll say 50, does that do? Shows you here what it does, so you can obviously increase that. Press save. And there we go. Now, sometimes you may get this. If we open, um, so I'll just show what I did there. If we press edit, project settings, and then what we'll do is we'll scroll down in the left here to rendering and scroll down to default settings and auto exposure. Now, if your scene looks like that where it's very dark, often it's the auto exposure that causes that. Now, a lot of the time when I'm creating things, I'll turn that off initially and then adjust it, um, add, add auto exposure in that in the end um, if, I, if I need it. So yeah, hopefully that helps. If it does, please give it a like and maybe subscribe.